Well, yesterday we told you about a website's ranking of the fastest growing cities in Michigan, with cold water coming out on top. Now that data comes from the U.S. Census Bureau, and it does accurately, accurately reflect the population counts according to the feds. But the Coldwater Daily Reporter says that comes with a caveat. Now, the city of Coldwater took over jurisdiction of Lakeland Correctional Facility from Coldwater's township in 2015. And the census data that Homesnacks.net used came from the American Community, Community Survey, which counts rural populations such as ours every few years, which counts for the sudden jump this year. According to the Associated Press, the Census Bureau doesn't make the distinction between prisoners and permanent residents as their definition of usual residence comes down to where a person lives and sleeps most of the time. Now, there have been efforts on the national level in a very, in, in, uh, and in various states across the country to change that, and several states, including Michigan, already have laws on the books that prevent prisoners from being counted towards political and public agency districts. Now, while the Census Bureau will continue to count prisoners as permanent residents, Acting Director Ron Jarman says breakdowns of prisoner populations will be made available to all states for redistricting purposes starting in early 2021.